How is everyone doing? Welcome back to another video. Now today we are doing something that of course everyone has been excited about and that is once again filling out our anime ID card. Now today we are filling out another one of those and we are filling out perhaps one of the best modern shonen anime of this generation and that is none other than Black Clover. Now if you haven't seen this series go ahead check out the entire series we are about halfway if not a little bit more done through this series so today we are going ahead and we are finding out what our magic knight squad am i yeah that that sounds kind of right now we are on pro probes quizzes we are doing the black clover quiz what magic knight squad are you this is going to be a 10 questions by whoever the hell that is don't know how to say it, not even gonna bother. If you wish to know what Magic Knight Squad you are in, try this epic Black Clover quiz and we will tell you the answer. Black Clover is a Japanese manga series that follows the story of a young boy, Asta, who was born without magical powers in a world where everyone possesses some sort of power. This quiz below will let you know what Magic Knight Squad you are from in the series. Play the quiz and have fun too. That's exactly what we are going to be doing. Let's go. All right, which of these is your favorite animal or bird? We've got the lion, the eagle, a bull, deer, or other. I'm not going to lie. Out of these, probably would go lion. But there's no chance that they're going to have panda on this. But it does say other, so we are going to do that in case panda is something that can be attributed to this. Number two. Which of these can define you the best? I am very serious. Always curious. I observe everything around me. I am aggressive and strong. People fear me. I would say I'm always curious. I'm not, I don't think I'm a very serious person. I observe most of stuff around me, but not all the time. I'm not a very aggressive person. And people do not fear me. Look at me. Do I look fear, fearable? Fearable. So we're gonna do always curious. What kind of grimoire do you wish to have? Strong one of any kind, a four-leaf clover. I don't mind any grimoire. I'll make it work. I'll be grateful just to get one. One that fit for a talent such as myself. A grimoire. Awesome. Any kind. Uh, to me, I'm not gonna lie. I really don't mind because I'll make it work. I would like it to be like kind of more like me, but I think I would go I don't mind because any grimoire that I make, I'll make it work. Number four, what can power give you? Fame, ability to protect the country. I can protect those I love to do whatever I want to prove my doubters wrong. Money, status, everything I could hope for. Fun, I can finally beat strong people. You know what? I feel like if I had the power, I'd be able to have the ability to protect the people I love or my country. Realistically, I'd probably go the ones that I love. I feel like that's a basic bitch answer, but that's okay. What describes you best? You can choose more than one. We've got fun. Honestly, I'm just going to go through them because there's a lot here. So we've got fun. I, I mean, I would say that describes me. Passionate. Stylish. Absolutely not. Careful. I'm going to go no. Lazy. No. Funny. I'm an, I'm, I think I'm funny. Not everyone has to think you're funny to be funny, so I'm going funny. Brave? I think so, but I don't know if a whole lot of people would say it. Loud? I would definitely say that. Selfish? Selfish? Uh, I don't think so. Special? Probably. Special needs? Haha. <laughs> Didn't. Shh. This, this goes back to the, the funny part. I think I'm funny. Loving? I think I am. Wrong. You know, these... These muscles, these muscles, they, they be showing how mm, call me Baki. Um, no, I don't really think so. Interesting, I would say. Smart, no. Artistic, no. Dumb, yes. Socially awkward, yeah. Prideful, 100%. Crazy, I've got a few screws loose, but I wouldn't say I'm crazy. You know, I feel like since I said that, I probably am. Uh, creative, I would say that. Multi-talented, I would not say that. Simple, I would definitely agree with that. On to the next one. You are up against a very strong opponent. What is your strategy? To knock that mother... The clean the hell out because I'm a god. Sorry, I've, I've had a lot of ego in the past couple days, so, uh, don't mind me. I'm strong myself. I'll just beat him straight on. See, that, that's what I'm talking about. 
I probably have no time to think, so I'll just use my strength and instincts. That's fair. If I don't give up, somehow I'll win. Fair. Analyze the opponent's weaknesses and depend on the team to exploit that. Run. I was hiding a trump card. I feel like knowing me, I'd probably rely on my instincts and strength. Your friend killed innocent people. What do you do? Ooh. Okay. But let's see what let's see what they have to say. Kill him slash her. No hard feelings. It's my duty. Don't think I could do that. Beat him slash her up so bad he slash she will regret it and become better. Forgive him slash her completely. Depends if the people he or she killed don't concern me. I couldn't care less. The courts will decide. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not gonna lie. If it, let's say if it's like my best friend and he killed an innocent person, I don't know what I would do, but I can guarantee you that I would stop them. Like, that's one thing that I can say. So, for this, I feel like it would be either beat him just, just because, but I think I would go I'm not entirely sure, if I'm being honest. Which ability sounds the coolest to you? Okay. Ability to stop time for a few seconds. Ability to control blue flames. Ability to destroy mountains with only my fists. I'd be down. Ability to summon dragons. Okay, this, this one's a winner right now. Ability to heal wounds. Get out of here. Ability to move at the speed of light. Ability to tame monsters and beasts. I could be down with that. Ability to teleport anywhere. Definitely agree with that. Ability to control all elements. That's overpowered as hell. Or all the above. That's also overpowered. I think the coolest is easy. Summon dragons. Like, what? Yes, of course. If a group of people attacked you, what would be your approach? I will just find a place to hide and wait for an opportunity to attack. I will defend myself. I will show them my strength. Depends on the situation. My anger is enough to burn them all. Oh, okay. If a group attacks me, that's different. Because if it's a group, I feel like I gotta like, you know, kind of see what's going on. If there are people I can take, then, then I'll fight them head on. But I mean, I feel like just based off my answer, it does depend on the situation. So we're going with that. And then the last one, how much would you rate yourself in wisdom out of 10? In wisdom? I'm gonna have to go like a I, I would say like a 4.5, just like just below average. Like if an average is five, I'm like right below. So it's either four below or five or six. So I have a coin. I need a coin. You know what? We're doing a coin. All right. We're living by the coin. We die by the coin. Uh, If it's heads, it's five or six. If it's tails, it's four or lower. It was four or below. Here we go, guys. We have now got all of our results in. Always, you guys know that the quiz was down below. So if you guys took the quiz with me, please let me know your results down below. And if you guys are curious on what my results are, I'm about to let you know in three, two, one. Waboom! Ah, kidding. Waboom! There we go. We got the black bulls. We are rough and aggressive. You believe that family and friends are the most important thing of all. Now, is that the basic answer? Yes. Do I care? No. You know why? Because I got luck right here. And he is a black bull, so by default, I'm fine with that. But we're going to go ahead, add that to the card, and we are, uh, we are done for today. So we will see you guys in the next one. Peace, bye, and boom.